Hi guys, uh, a lot of you have known the box multiplication method. Um, I am new to this, but I thought it would be helpful to start a video chain for the box division method as well that is fairly new. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and start and show you guys um, and where you guys get lost a lot is um, the same as everybody else, so just follow along. Okay, so we're gonna go seven, goes into nine, goes in one time. One times seven is seven. I'm gonna do my subtraction. I get two left over, okay? Now instead of bringing down, which is where everybody gets lost, I'm gonna go ahead and bring this two up here, okay? Now, I'm gonna say seven goes into 24 three times. Three times seven is 21. I'm gonna subtract, I'm gonna get three. I'm gonna do the same exact thing. Instead of bringing the two down, I'm gonna bring the three up. There's my three. Seven goes into 32 four times. Four times seven is 28. I'm going to subtract. I have four left over. I have a remainder of four. Okay, I'm gonna do another one that's a little bit longer and help you guys out there. Okay, so let's start here. Okay, five goes into seven one time. One times five is five. I'm gonna subtract. I have two left over. Okay, I'm gonna bring this two up here. Okay, five goes into 24 four times. Four times five is 20. I'm gonna subtract and have four left over. I'm gonna bring my four up here. Everybody gets lost at that bring down stage and starting over. We're gonna go ahead and bring it up instead. Five goes into 48 nine times. Nine times five is 45. Subtract, I get three left over. I'm bringing my three up. Five goes into 32, six times. Six times five is 30. I'm going to subtract and have two left over, remainder two. Okay, I know it looks a little funky when you first getting used to it, but I swear it's not that bad, okay? I'm gonna do one more for you guys, okay? Okay, so this does, doesn't have my boxes on it yet. So I'm gonna show you, I'm putting it right at the end of my previous box so that I have room to bring up my number, okay? All right, so, okay. Six doesn't go into five. I'm gonna put a placeholder, okay? Six is gonna go into 54. Well, that's nine times. Nine times six is 54. I get nothing left over, that's perfect. Now, six doesn't go into three, so I have to put a zero there, okay? Now, I'm just gonna move my three over, okay? Crossing it off so I don't try and use it again, okay? Now six goes into 32 five times. Five times six is 30. Subtract, get two, remainder two. Okay, I really hope that was helpful, guys. Enjoy.